Hey, another Lambert W function problem on the board. We have x 10 to the x equals 3. thought this was a fun problem just because, in a way, it's really in, it's really already in our format almost, except for instead of an e, we have a 10 here. And the good thing about that actually is that whenever we have a number, we can always get our e by rewriting it. So like for our 10, we can write it as e to the ln 10. So let's just rewrite our whole thing. We'll have an x in front and an x exponent equals 3. Then let's just multiply our 10 in here. So we're gonna have x, e, ln 10. Let's just make it clear that we're multiplying there. x equals three. And now we're getting pretty close to this form that we want. We've got our e in the middle, and we have x's in the exponent. All we need to do to make this work is let's just multiply both sides by an ln 10. And then you'll notice we're, now we're matching the exponent and coefficient. And now that we're matching what's in red, we can use our Lambert W function. So we'll apply it on both sides. Oh, I didn't get myself, yeah, I'm okay. And then so on the left side, this is just gonna spit out x ln 10. Then on the right side, we're gonna have number w3 ln 10. And then I can just divide by ln 10 just so that will isolate our x. This will cancel. And we're left with this for our solution. So we just wanna know I kind of like to feel more comfortable if we get a decimal answer for this. So this is going to be about, when I put this in Wolfram Alpha, this came to 0 0.6588. And that answer makes sense because if, if you put in ones around, if you had x is 1, then you just have 10. So it needs to be less than 1. Then how do we know there isn't another real solution lurking somewhere? Well, the thing is, the input of the Lambert W here is a positive number. Our Lambert W function, real sloppy graph, is going to be something like this. So all of our positive values of the Lambert W function have just one real solution on real part on this graph. You'd have to be in this area to have multiple real solutions. So we're just going to have one real solution for this, 0 0.6588. Got this problem from my quiz, Lambert W challenge. You can check that out. I also have a similar one, Lambert W function. They get kind of two separate strategies, but there's a lot of good problems like this and you can get some practice. Thanks for watching.